What's up guys, it's Tom here and welcome back to the Liverpool Carrier Mode Show with a brand new episode and as you can see the title race is very close, Arsenal won their game in hand and they are just 4 points behind us so every game is a big big pressure game and we have some incredibly big games coming up after Watford we are playing Man City, Manchester United, Paris Saint-Germain, Stoke City who are in the top 4 so they are a big team Paris Saint-Germain again and then Leicester City in the FA Cup semi-finals who finished in the top four last season so all the games uh, are big even this Watford game is very important because if we drop points here Arsenal could come very very close to us guys if you enjoy this series smash the like button leave a like and let me know in the comments below where are you watching from which country which city are you watching from and don't worry when I'm back from my skiing holiday, I will include two or three games in every episode and the press conferences will return and everything. I'm just recording this video in advance. Here we go boys, welcome to Watford, the Liverpool. And this game feels like a cup final. Every single game feels like a cup final. The countdown to the season finale has started because we only have 10 games left in the Premier League season. And let's see what kind of statistic the game highlights. So Liverpool are the best defensive team in the Premier League. And also we are the best attacking team with the most goals scored. Let's keep that run going, hopefully, against Watford. And I'm really looking forward to this. Steven Gerrard captains the side. And that is... Oh my... What the... <laughs> oh, the most weird start. The weirdest start to a game. I have seen... Oh no. Oh, go on, Mere. What is that? Alright. Watford really messed that up. But then Gerard and Murphy running into each other. That's hilarious. Go on, Flanagan. The scouts are kafu. Uh, what I usually try to do is overload one side with players. Oh, Moreno. Oh, Moreno unlucky. I didn't expect that challenge to come in. And this is where Gerard is lacking, he just doesn't have the pace. But he actually has a pretty decent... Oh, come on! Oh, no. Nice. Nice nutmeg. Oh, and did I mention that Sturridge is back? from his injury Go on Bailey! What a miss! Ho ho! Oh that is a really good combination play Bailey should have buried it So unlucky Come on Bailey Oh love that Turn back Nice Gerard To Dembele No Pereira miss. Oh wow, Watford going direct here. Never mind, we have the ball. I like that if they do that. If they hoof the ball. Oh, look at Bailey. What a run. Oh, please, I passed it and the pass gets intercepted. And now we are a little bit short. Yes, I had a feeling that I just need to track the runners. And there won't be any problem. Moreno. Wow, 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 wow. My passing is not there today. So far. But at least the high press works like a charm. Go on, Dembele. Come on. Oh, I see an opening here. Storage. Wow, did you see how quickly the defender dispossessed me? Go on. Come on. Oh, Alexander Arnold surely! Yes! He has done it! Alexander Arnold! Yes! Lovely build up play, very patient. As you see, I waited for Arnold to get into the space between two defenders. Great assist by Bailey, and Arnold was always going to score that. The young Steven Gerrard, that's how I call Alexander Arnold, because he, he's also an all round great midfielder and uh, it's 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 so amazing to see the apprentice learning from the master himself the legend steven gerrard liverpool mr captain fantastic mr liverpool and they are on the same pitch and gerrard i bet 
congratulated Arnold on another goal in his Liverpool career and he's like what 19 20 years old so the young Steven Gerrard remember that guy oh and then, just as I was talking about him he asks for the ball go on son nice one Moreno make the run there we go okay when I don't have any options oh my god Billy! Oh no! Oh, I, I knew it! Bailey gets an injury. Oh. Bailey just doesn't have any luck with injuries. Let's bring on Danny Ings because I was thinking about starting Danny Ings or not. He just came back from injury. So hopefully. Oh yeah, this shot was blocked. I was thinking about doing a skill move, but I thought, you know what, maybe let's have a shot because Bailey maybe he could get away from the defender it was a bad decision because not only the shot was blocked but Bailey got injured great steal storage storage also came back from his injury ah. oh the keeper <laughs> that's why you need to press the keeper because he made a mistake I mean yeah come on Oh, that is a bad pass by Arnold. Oh, okay, okay. Just keep the ball. And now we are starting to dominate, really. This is what I love. Possession football. Keeping the ball, passing it around. Nice. Oh, go on, Moreno. Uh, the pass got intercepted. Oh, great steal. Come on, Danny! Dennings! What a goal! <laughs> Just came on! Just came on as a substitute! <laughs> what an incredible strike! Dennings! You absolute beauty between the defender's legs! Smashing hit! Get in, son! What a finish! Look at that! Beauty! Let's let's keep attacking, guys. I want the third, I want the fourth. Gerard! And the rebound doesn't fall. Never mind. Good try, good try, Stevie. Good try, Stevie. Yes, what a half. Brilliant. This is how champions play. Clinical in front of goal. Three shots on target, two goals. And we can already start thinking about the Man City and Man United games. I think those will be proper title deciders. If we can maybe collect like four or three points from those two games then we have one foot i mean one hand on the trophy so it's it's vital to close this game out why did you stop running danny oh damn it ah <laughs> i carried the ball out this is what high pressing does to you keep telling you guys oh oh storage oh come on Nah, nah, ref. Ah. Oh, come on. Win that, win that. Beautiful. Counter attack. Oh, Danny Ings. Danny Ings! That's a pen! That is a penalty! That was inside the box, ref. It's a red card. It should be a red card. It was, he was the last man. Come on, where's the card? There we go. Yes, red card. Yes, come on, let's hammer Watford. Cabasele gets a red card. Let's watch this again. Was it inside the box? Uh, I think it was. It was inside the box. Yes, do we? we yes, we get the penalty. Yeah, let's let's give it to Gerard. Let's give it to Gerard. Come on, Gerard. Yes, Steven Gerard. Gerard is big as it. Fucking hard! He smashes the ball in from 40 yards! Stevie Gerard, Gerard! You know the name, son! <laughs> you know the name, son! Oh, that is brilliant! That is a great pan by Gerard! Wasn't in the corner, but the, thankfully the goalkeeper didn't move! And it's free now! Oh, come on, boys! Let's have the absolute go fast here. I'm so happy that I'm doing a full game live commentary for this game. As you can properly see how you beat a legendary computer. Oh, don't jinx it, Tom. Don't jinx it. Great block.
Brilliant! Oh, what a goal! Oh, that is beautiful! The football that we are playing is just something else. It's mesmerizing. I love playing like this. And Dembele finds the top corner with a fantastic curling finish. Finesse shots are OP. That is a lovely goal. And I think, no, maybe I will make some substitutions because, you know, the game is pretty much won. Do we have some players who need some minutes? Yeah, Vina Doom probably does. Let's bring him on for Murphy and uh, let's give Gerard a rest because he's getting a little bit tired. You know what? No, let's keep Gerard on because he has been just brilliant. And let's bring Mane on. 4 nil already. Watford with 10 men. We have 23 minutes left. I wonder what will be the final score. I really hope that I can score maybe one more. Or maybe more. Go on. Go on, Stevie. Go on. <laughs> Oh, uh, my Scouser accent impersonation is not the best. Oh boy. Oh no. This game is not over yet because... Come on, plan again. Okay. Go kick. Brilliant, ref. Brilliant. We have... 49... We have 51% possession. Alright. I thought it, I thought it will be more. Look at that coast control by Danny Ings. And Moreno. When you don't have options in front of you, then oh, money! <laughs> then you sometimes you just turn back and restart building the attack. That's what I do, and that's what I think serves me so well. Come on, come on! They have ten men. Oh, and look at Sturridge. I mean. He is just such an injury prone player. The good news is that I think we don't have any substitutes and how FIFA works is that when uh, you, you made all your substitutions then you basically cannot get a player injured because you can't go off. <laughs> but ah, oh, storage, come on. Damn it, storage. Come on, Stevie. Long shot, bang! Alright, yeah. It's not Gerard in his prime. When we signed him, I think he was 78 rated. He's now 74 rated. But he still scored a penalty, so... And he also scored a screamer before this one. Previously in the season. Oh, boy. Come on, Yamat. Don't play around. Yeah, just leave it. Just leave it. They really messed that up. Five minutes left. Come on, let's try and get one more, guys. Let's try and get one more. What word are absolutely gone? Come on, Danny. Danny Ings! Can he? No, he can't. Ah! For a second, I thought that would be the moment for Danny Ings to score the fifth goal, but no. Oh, what a header by Gerard. And look at Gerard on the run. Go on, Mane! Ooh. The last minute that his shot is blocked. I think uh, Watford are just praying for the final whistle. They are saying to the ref, please end our misery, end our humiliation. To lose at home 4 0. Wow. Watford fans must be absolutely livid with the team. And we completely outplayed them. Oh, Fl even Flanagan are doing... Yes, what a win! Fantastic result! Absolutely brilliant victory! Loved it! What a magnificent result! Dembele, Ings, Gerard, and Alexander Arnold scored! And I love all of them! I love all of these players! I'm so happy for them! And we played Watford after, after Park! I really hope that you guys uh, got something out of this uh, full game live commentary! Hopefully. Uh, you will be able to play better FIFA against the legendary computer. Oak City lost to Swansea, which is a bitter, bitter pill for them. And I'm really disappointed because I, I'm actually rooting for little Stoke City to gatecrash the top four. 
for the second season in a row and try to get in ahead of Manchester United and Chelsea but that loss now Chelsea are right on their heels uh, and Man United are now ahead of Stoke. Stoke City could have gone third and our, the pressure again is on Arsenal and effectively our lead is like seven points plus we have a better goal difference so it's eight points on Arsenal so if they drop points in the next game you know we have a good cushion to work with and we play Man City and Manchester United in the next two league games top scorers in the Premier League so yeah Dybala didn't play and Coman didn't play in this one I rested them for the big Man City game but uh, we are still scoring an insane amount of goals and I'm so so happy about that Coutinho has seven assists which is also very good and Karius has nine clean sheets and Donnarumma has five that's it. that's actually remarkable that's it for today's liverpool carry with episode really hope that you guys enjoyed it if you did smash the like button thanks for watching see you later guys good night